<coughs> niggas turning my key, niggas getting me started. I can't go where a nigga how big your pawn. A 300 blackout, I feel like a spawn. A step back, bust him in his face like oh. What is good, YouTube family? You know what I'm saying? It's your boy Jerry coming at you with another video. And today, we got a video from Fresh and Fit. Hold on, let me look at the title because I ain't even. Hold up, y'all. I'm going to kind of move us real quick. Yo, yo, okay. Uh, does your girl care about what you want? I always find these videos interesting um, from Fresh and Fit and everything. Because, like, what I think, bro. Hold up. What I think, and it might, it, I might be wrong. I, I don't care if I'm wrong. Before I continue, it's it's not that deep to me. Motherfuckers act like if you wrong, it's like, oh, you're wrong. Uh, uh. Like, it's not that deep, bro. All this shit opinionated anyway, so. It's really not a right or wrong in my opinion, because it's my opinion. But anyway, um, it don't really be that deep. Just find somebody that connect with you. It's not that deep. Like, it's really simple actually and we make it so hard we make so much shit in life so hard like having a whole panel it's a smart idea from the fresh and fit niggas right but it's just like having a whole panel of these women and you spewing nothing but like topics that they you know is gonna trigger them so it's it's, it's easy content which is basically what i'm saying it's easy content because at the end of the day um being masculine, you know what I'm saying? Alpha male, all that, uh, you know what I'm saying? All that little cool shit. That's not everybody, bro. I don't even have a desire to do that. Like, fuck, it. niggas be like, niggas are made to procreate. And that don't mean you got to go fuck on each and every woman. You know what I'm saying? That's not an excuse. So if, if she, if you feel like, I just view it like, if you going to go cheat, and she go cheat, you can't get mad about that. Because, nigga, you was cheating. I don't see how that's such a hard... Why can't we all just only fuck with the one person we got? Why does it gotta... You know what I'm saying? So, I don't feel like the girl is wrong. If she go fuck on somebody else because you was... Fuck, like, nigga, you fucking on somebody? What, what? That don't make common sense. That don't... Like, you can't expect somebody to stay loyal to you. If you're not staying loyal to them. It's, it's two plus two equal four. You know what I'm saying? It's it's simple as that. But anyway, um, that's aside from all the other stuff they be spewing. Like they be spewing a bunch of stuff. You know what I'm saying? And shout out to them, they doing their thing. You know what I'm saying? Keep going up. You know what I'm saying? I just don't agree with everything they say, which is fine. I'm not supposed to agree with everybody. I ain't no fucking yes, man. The fuck? Anyway, we finna um get into the video. All right. No. First question is, ladies, if you found a man, wait before we start. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna just show y'all real quick. I didn't feel like making no food or nothing. So I got me some, got me some candy, you know? I got me, hey, if y'all ain't ever had these from 7-Eleven, the, it's, what's they called? Gummy, apple rings, green, green apple, you know what I'm saying? You need to fuck with them. These, the peach rings, all of them, they slap, nigga. This is what we eating for breakfast this morning. We got these, and then we got, the, we got some water. It'll hold you. All right, let's go ahead. Let's get into it. If you found a man that you wanted, right? Do you care what he actually wants from you? I will start right here. Of course. 100%. Of course I care what he wants from me. But do you ever ask? <laughs> ask what he wants? Mm -hmm. Of course. I'm straight up. Of course. I not. ask, I ask, what do you want? First of all, out of a relationship, what do you want out of life? What do you want as a man? Mm -hmm. What are you looking for? I'm not going to get into a relationship with somebody without knowing what they want. So, just to double, double down on this, if he says to you, you know what, I care about you, I want you, but no girls nights out. No girl nights out? Yeah. That's one of his requirements. <sighs> ah, do you really care, though? Do I really care about girl nights out? No, about him. About him? <laughs> 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 oh, you're asking tough questions over here. <laughs> I do care about him. If I care about, I mean, 
I dare someone to tell me I can't go out. Right. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Do you want that first? You don't want your girl I to be able to go out first. Right. But, no, but, but is, why are they controlling? That's an extreme example. I'm just, because that's girls, very controlling. Like there are people like that. But that's controlling. That's, yeah. that's controlling. that's very controlling. That's not just unhealthy. Control. Are you my parent, though? You got to get out of Did that. Did you birth me? Exactly. You're not my father. You're not my dad. Toodaloo. Daddy, but not so, dad. I ask again. There's a difference. Requirements. Do I care about his requirements? Yes, but there is a limit. There's a boundary. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Myron pulled out the so, notebook, guys. So, so you, 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 <laughs> this is very important. So you decide the limit, right? No, we both decide the limit together. Oh, he's telling we you compromise. That's a requirement. That's not a requirement. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Understandable. What about you? Um, I think that um I would definitely um ask uh why. Like if if a guy asked, told me he didn't want me to go out. I would be okay. So why? I'd be like, I'd be like, why? Why do you not want me? And then try to come to a compromise. Like I don't have to go out every weekend mm -hmm. and, and see if, you know, we can come to some sort of agreement or compromise. But definitely, I do consider what they want, um, and try to please them. And if I, if it's totally against my beliefs and how I feel, then we have to have a whole different conversation. Can you cook? I can cook chicken off right now. <laughs> so, I'll give, I'll give an example. So one of the, one of his uh, standards or requirements is, hey, you know what? I want you to cook for me at least twice a week. Yeah, I feel I definitely would be willing to do that and Check learn. You know, <laughs> like, you know, I'm just, I, but that's like, the thing about me. I'm okay. open to a challenge, and you know, what I'm saying, I'm not saying that a cooking, is, not saying that cooking is a challenge. <laughs> you know, <laughs> she's talking about like Listen, the process. I'm just saying in general, in general, oh. in general, I'm I'm open to a challenge, and, and if it's not against like my core, making food. <laughs> like in general, but, like but if it's cooking, yeah. yes, I I would cook. I I'm, I you know I'm gonna cook for my man. So you know would you? I'm gonna learn. And I should care about your man's standards then? Yes. Okay. Definitely. What about you? Do you care about your man's standards? I actually do. Because I always <laughs> like to see people's perspectives. <laughs> um, I would ask him, like, if he had a problem, like, oh, I don't like you going out and stuff. I would want to know why. Like, why do you feel like it's a problem that I go out? Or All right, man. Hold on. I'm going to just pause it real quick. Okay. Of course. Most of the time, when you go out, bro... <clears throat> All right, so if you go out with your girls, I have I wouldn't have no problem, all right? But it's like, I wouldn't before. So recently, you know what I'm saying? I got cheated on. It happens. I'm not really tripping on it. I wish them the best. You know what I'm saying? Do their thing. Uh, I'm not like a, I, I don't really hold, I, I don't hold grudges. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't do that. I just, it just like, I don't see a point in you being in my life if you made that decision. You know what I'm saying? Right. I bring that up because it's like she was out with her girls doing her thing. But I was such a trustworthy person. I was like, you know what? Go do it. So the reason it's like most of the time when you go out, you go get drunk. You go get drunk. You go do a bunch of other shit. You know what I'm saying? That you ain't really got no business doing if you in a relationship. You know what I'm saying? If you, I'm not saying if you in a relationship, you can't, you can't, um, you can't go out because I mean you you supposed to still have fun and everything. But nobody wants to feel like they have to baby you. You know what I'm saying? Nobody, I don't. Who want to feel like the hell? Nobody, nobody want to be around anybody 25 eight, bro. I'm gonna be real with you. At least I don't. It's just the trusting part. It's a whole, you got, it's a whole thing with trusting. So it is kind of tough being like, yeah, just go out. When you've been fucked over time after time after time, you know what I'm saying? From shit like that. And people can't understand that. I don't get why people can't understand that or why people are like, oh, that just, that just doesn't make sense to me. Cause if I haven't done you wrong, nigga, just cause you, just cause you ain't done me wrong. Don't mean there's not a chance that you can do me wrong. You know what I'm saying? So like that logic is pathetic. You know what I'm saying? In my opinion, that logic is dumb because if if somebody has been fucked over, you can't expect them to just turn that switch to I. Right, you know what I'm saying? I'm fully trusting you again. You gotta build that. That takes time. You know what I'm saying? So if it's early in a relationship and he says that's a requirement at the time, you know what I'm saying? If you're not fucking with that, yeah, dip. Because it might not be something that he's sitting there like trying to bash you, but that's just something he require. 
for being with him. You know what I'm saying? And that's, I don't think that that's wrong of that person. You know what I'm saying? I, I feel like, but I do see like you wanting to have your, your freedom and shit like that. But if you want to have your freedom and all type of shit, then I, I don't know. Because if, if the roles were reversed, boom, let me say that. And I go out. You, it's not gonna be the same. Like you gonna be tripping. Most of the time, females be tripping about shit like that anyway. If we being honest with you, like how many times y'all heard the line? He was out all night, and and I ain't know where he was or what he was doing. It would be the same damn thing if the roles were reversed. But it's just not taken into account. You know what I'm saying? Whenever it's the nigga, because I don't. I honestly don't know. I honestly don't know. So, but yeah. What is the trust issue within that, you know, me going out? Because, you know, I'm going out to have fun and just kind of like, you know, relax a little bit, you know, hang out fun. with my girls. <laughs> well, fun for me is mm -hmm. not really a clubbing thing. I'm not a club person. Um, I would like to go out, actually do brunch maybe, or what just... If he, what if he told you, you know what? Fuck going out. Instagram page. Don't respond to random niggas on Instagram. I can respect that because you That's feel some type of way. Mm -hmm. That that you want that out of me, so I can respect that. That's the bare minimum. Of what not if he responding. said no Instagram? Right. No Ooh. butt pics. At all? I would want no, like delete your whole Instagram. No bikini pics. No, delete your whole Instagram. But that's part of her career. She said. That's a part of my career. Yeah. So now you want me to delete you my Instagram. You want me to delete my Instagram, but then I'm tarnishing my promotion because I'm promoting myself. If, if his work is different, though. But yeah. That's my Instagram. Yeah. It's based it's off work. my work. Yeah. So if you want me to delete my Instagram, <laughs> then why do you want me to tarnish my career? Do you not want me to grow? Because I really, right now in my life, don't see myself doing anything other. I've done my backup plan. I've graduated from college. So why do you want me to stop? Now, is it your insecurities? I will point that out. Where is the root of everything? Because that's what I'm doing with my life, mm -hmm. finding the root of my issues. Mm -hmm. So if you present something and I'm being your woman. So to just bring this home. So your man gives you a crime or standards. You, mm -hmm. just, you would ask questions, clarify why he wants it, and then adhere to it or say no. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like I would adhere to it or <laughs> say no. Yeah. Like it is what it is. Nina, what about you? If you care about um, your man's standards. I do, <laughs> as long as he meets no. my standards. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> okay. And what are, what are your standards? I just really want someone who is actually going to be working like a man. <laughs> oh. Wait. Oh. What does that mean? <laughs> yeah, that's... What we need. Details. What does that mean? We need details. Men came here to work and sweat. Okay. <laughs> you want me chopping trees and that's shit? That's your right? own <laughs> hey, yo. I got a bill table. Water. <laughs> yeah, like a man should be able to do everything. Like freaking fix the hole in the wall. A man should be able to do everything. <laughs> that is a lot That's of a lot. requirement. Man, hell, all right, look, bro, look. So this should come up, all right. Yeah, man, man, you know, I agree. You know, we should be able to do a good portion of shit. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, that don't mean you can just sit on your ass and not do nothing. That's an excuse. That's an excuse. You know what I'm saying? Women like... Women like to do that shit. They just like to be like, well, I'm the woman. I don't I don't know how to... Just because you don't know how to do certain shit don't mean you can't learn or don't mean that you. I have to do every single thing. And by her logic, that's what she just said. Like, men are supposed to be able to do every single thing. Then you're not going to... You may not be able to get a man because, at, you know what I'm saying? At the same time, ain't nobody finna... That's, that's babying you. So at the like I said, nobody want to sit there and have to baby you. You feel me? Like that that makes you seem like I don't know if I'm with a woman or a, a girl, like a like a little girl, like a daughter. Like I'm treating you like my daughter. You know what I'm saying? If I'm doing every single thing for you, that's how I feel. You know what I'm saying? I get that, man. We supposed to take care of the women. You know what I'm saying? All type of shit. But there's just some shit. Like, you even see in the marriages, like, that's why they be arguing, arguing a good portion of the time because it's about, like, what I'm doing and what you're not doing. And you know what I'm saying? It could, like, take away so many arguments, so much stress, and so much extra shit if everybody just did their part. You know what I'm saying? I don't really agree with that. I agree with some of it. 
And we should do a good portion of shit like fixing the tire, if we of tire on the road and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Stuff, little stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? But her being like, men should do everything. It's it's not that doesn't really. You know what I'm saying? It shouldn't be every fucking thing. You know what I'm saying? So it is what it is. But okay. For a man. I'm just saying, for like, a man. I'm just saying, nowadays, like, they, most men just nowadays, so they give you just like, oh my god, I broke my nail bond. Oh my god, I broke my nail bond. Oh, so you want a man to talk? She's like, yeah. She's like, yeah. So, question. If your guy says, I care about you, Nina, I care about you, I want to go long term, 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 I want to she, she gonna do it because you're there, right? She gonna do it because you're there. It's only on the pressure of this. Y'all are not random. Y'all are not random. You asked an easy question. What if he told you that you can't sell leggings because you gotta promote it with your boobs? Wait, ooh. No, no, no. We believe it's business. It's different. You don't wanna just That's your income. You don't wanna just shut off on the girls. You don't wanna just shut off on the girls. You're girls. So business is fine. Lifestyle is different. So business is fine. But. Is so, that, money up. Not going to yacht because it, would you if not going to yacht because it says so? If he pays for yes. my living, I know yes. it's my downfall. It's okay. I know it's my downfall. <laughs> it's okay. Living, living, or or living, or any of your like, does it have to just be living? Like, yeah, does it have to just be living? He has to cover my life and my future. Cover my life cover and my, my, life life and my, my future, too. My future too. Basically, be in charge of you. So, if he's taking care of you, she'll listen to what he has to say. She don't want to do shit. That's what it is. She don't want to do shit. She don't want to do shit. She don't want to do shit, bro. She wants you. Well, hey, she the type, you know, yeah. Uh, we walking past the dope. Uh, yeah, get that dope for me. You know what I'm saying? She dropped some oatmeal on the floor. Because you clean that up, please. I don't know why it's on the floor. Whenever she 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 get off the pot shitting, she wants you to come in there and wipe her ass. She wants you to do everything. She don't want to do shit. She don't want to do nothing, my nigga. If she got to do anything as little as flip the light on, she going to be fussing at night. I see why she probably single right now. I'm going to keep it a bean with you. Because ain't, ain't, ain't nobody doing all that, bro. Ain't nobody doing all that shit. Ain't nobody doing all that shit. Ain't nobody doing all that shit for you. I'm sorry. Why do people, What make you so special? And then when niggas be like, what do you bring to the table? They get mad. They get mad as hell. Like, and you... I, oh, my gosh. I don't get that. That, that that made me mad. That made me mad. You know what I'm saying? I don't like her answers. Do what you do, but I don't know. Maybe somebody will be cool with that. Maybe somebody will be cool with sitting there and sucking your... Well, I mean, of course, I'm cool with sucking the titty. But sitting there and wiping your ass. You know what I'm saying? All day. But I ain't, I ain't with that shit. I, I, I don't know how many other niggas is with that shit. But best of luck to you, my G. Yeah. But if it's not, it's like, fuck you, nigga. Or yeah, no, exactly. So she wants to be okay. a dependent. No, okay. it's not she even about that. Claim That's exactly what it is. It's claim not, the taxes. It no, wants it's... to pay for everything and do everything for you. That's exactly what. No, what do you mean? Is. Not do everything. Like I'm gonna be cooking and cleaning no, and doing. A man. I gotta ask you some so, so basically, what, what you're money. saying, what like, you're saying is like live your and... life. The thing but... is that I think most men nowadays are very lazy. Yeah. And they're very like okay with living a mediocre life. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yes, okay. I didn't want to say those I words, but and, all right, I'm not done. I'm not done. Whenever people say like the generalization, you know what I'm saying? Be like most men this or a lot of men that. There is a like billions of niggas. You ain't even seen half of that. You ain't even seen a portion for real. Like uh uh uh. You know what I'm saying? So you making these generalizations off of. All you seeing is off of a social media post, probably. Off some comments in the comment section, which really don't mean up to nothing. Because actions speak louder than words. They could be saying that shit. But how many times you done said some shit on the internet? It's not really how you feel. You just said it for real. There's a bunch of people that be talking. And on top of that, social media is a bunch of kids. A good portion of the time. It's a bunch of fucking kids, bro. You know what I'm saying? So... She could be reading the comments from like a kid that just don't understand it all yet. You know what I'm saying? So really, this the mindset she, it seemed like she got is from a, a a little girl mindset, bro. And that's not me bashing her. You know what I'm saying? I, I ain't with the bashing. I'm just keeping it a band, bro. 
we can't be moving like this. We can't. I'm sorry. We can't. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. For you. Requirement I don't standards? give a fuck what the, I, uh, whatever she wants to do. That's fine with me. If it doesn't align with what I do, <laughs> I let her go. Oh, no. She's asking you. You know what, Cinco? I love you. I care about you. But I don't like you going to do interviews in public with girls. Like, I don't like that. No, nah, work comes first. That's like you need to put your work first no matter what. If anything comes in between that, you should drop the person. You shouldn't let anyone fuck up your money. Okay. Okay. Sneeko, I don't like that shirt. Do you agree? That you're wearing. <laughs> you don't like my shirt? No, no. She says that to you. Man. Yeah, but, but but fresh. Get a man with a better shirt. <laughs> he's wearing, wait, 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 wait but, but but fresh. Okay. He's wearing zebra and uh, she, she's wearing zebra too. We match. We coordinate. Oh, there you go. So yeah, fresh. You go. You know, what about you? Um, me, absolutely. Like, if my man wasn't comfortable with something that I was doing, I would do whatever I need to to make him feel comfortable. Especially because the one I have now, like, he would do literally anything to make sure I'm comfortable. Can you so, cheat? I mean, it. And that that's that that's girl in the pink. Holla at hey, holla at your boy. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? Holla, holla at your boy. Cause we we might we might got something. You know what I'm saying? We might got something. Look, as far as financial shit go, I'ma get there. You know it's gonna take a little time. You know what I'm saying? But if, if you just come fuck with the team, we not the team, not the team, not the team, just me. Let me reword what I said. I don't need you fuck with all these other niggas. Like you said, the comfortability that wouldn't make me comfortable. I would be very uncomfortable with you fucking with other niggas. Just fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? And, and we'll be good. Cause you you seem like you like you you good with the compromisation and shit like that, and you know how to compromise. So like I said, holla at your boy. Cause we ain't finna do all this shit. <clears throat> with the that's how our relationship should be it's a sacrifice you compromise your sacrifice you want to go out with your girl and shit you want to go out with your girls go do the shit you know what i'm saying no if i don't if, if i don't feel comfortable with that it then, then then you know what i'm saying it shouldn't be such a hard task if you didn't feel comfortable with me doing it then you you'll tell me right you, women women are very good at voicing their opinions you know what i'm saying voicing how the fuck they feel about certain shit but when a nigga do it seemed like he just they just wanna make it like he crying about something. You know what I'm saying? So that's what we as niggas, that's what we need to do. When these females come at you and they like they telling you all this shit, just be like, damn, you really crying right now. You know what I'm saying? Watch the backlash you get, bro. It's crazy. The double standards in this life is wild to me, bro. It's wild. If he really wants to, that's part of the sexual okay. needs. He just talked to me about it, but Oh. I know he's not gonna do that. So, you so you're that. willing for open? Okay, so so if he if he just happened to like fall into some pussy, oh <laughs> so if he just to happened fall to fall into it, yeah, slip. Yeah. Which I don't think will happen, but because he like where he is at, he like where he's hey, at. for now. That's cool. Now, not even know for now, Chris. I already <laughs> told you. <laughs> this is the old one that came back. They uh, always come back. DTV. Yeah. Mm. Talking shit. Nigga says to you, disturbing the bitches. Look, girl. I'm gonna take care of you. I got your back. Eh. <laughs> Don't oh. tell me what the fuck to do. <laughs> 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 I, don't give a, I make the rules. I wear the pants in this motherfucking house. Yeah. Okay. And you still gonna pay the bills. <laughs> or are you not getting none of this pussy? See, when you got good pussy. And then here's, bro. Oh. Here's, bro. Whoa! It's just like, it's just like you had to open your mouth. You know what I'm saying? Like, they should have they skipped over you for real. You know what I'm saying? Cause, cause the shit you said, it's like, it don't even add up. How you wear the pants, you ain't paying no bills. Nigga, you wearing shorts. You ain't wearing shorts for real, nigga. You wearing panties, which is what you need to wear every time I come in the house. Because you ain't paying for shit. You ain't doing shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm taking care of you. You are my kid. You're my, you're, you, you know what I'm saying? Like, you are my kid. I can't tell, that's what, I can tell you where to go. At that point, because I'm paying all the bills, I'm doing, I'm taking care of you. You are my, you are, what, your, what did your parents do for you? And then whenever they, whenever your parents told you some shit, you know what I'm saying? And you had to follow. You did. Why? You ain't had nothing else going. You ain't had shit to do. You ain't, you ain't got nothing. If them niggas kicked you out, you was really on your own for real. You ain't had shit. It's the same thing. It's the same logic. You see what I'm saying? You are you you. I'm treating you like a kid. 
because I'm taking care of you like a kid. That, that's just how it works. I don't understand that shit. And then the fact that you think that your pussy got superpowers to where I'm supposed to just, yes, ma'am. Okay, that, that's how it's going to go. I understand. Yo, it's not that good, fam. You know, I'm going to be real with you. It's not that good. I'm going to keep... I know it's going to break your heart. And I know it's going to make you think like, no, there's no way. I got that wet, wet, that guava, guava, that you, you, it's not, it's not that deep. And some niggas really be getting possessed by this pussy. Y'all, look, I'm telling y'all, it's not, it's really not, it's, it really ain't that deep. You know, it might be because it's like all you know, you know, but it's not. There's, think about all the bitches out there with fat asses. Good titties, fat asses, good pussy, right? Or what, what, whatever you want to call it. I, I guess, I don't know why. I don't know. I don't understand that, but, you know, you, you going to do your thing. Rock out. You know what I'm saying? Rock, 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 rock out. You can make your old motherfucker fools. I got good pussy. Okay. So they, my niggas listen to me. All right, so what's uh, <laughs> good about it, though? I can't tell you. How many girls say the same thing? Yeah, but they say the same thing, but do they live the same thing? Mm. Okay. That's the difference. Right. That Anybody life. can say they got good pussy, but will, who is what, really... What makes your pussy so good? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I got to ask the niggas. They say it's know. really wet and, like, it's they wet. say, like, it'd be, like, it, it, like, I'd be... Is it tight? It's tight. It's, tight. Yeah. it's wet. It'd be, like, squirt. Uh, it's a lot of shit be going on down squirt? there. Mm. I don't even try to find out. Can you squirt on command, or is it... No, I can't. It's not that good. Yeah, yeah, oh, facts. 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 yeah, yeah. It's, it's, Ooh, it depends on the dick. The dick I mean, make me yeah, work. Different dicks down. make it work. And if my dick got my dick got to activate your pussy, no, nah, that ain't working, fam. Cause your your pussy is is the ultimate. You got ultimate tier pussy, right? So I should be able to just look at your shit in this waterfall guava. You know what I'm saying? Cause that's how you speaking about it. If I'm paying all your bills. Yo pussy should just get wet. I, I, I should just say pussy. And that shit should just, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Just come out. You know what I'm saying? All type of shit. It's, you feel me? You have to have the ultimate pussy. If, th if this how you speaking on it. You know what I'm saying? You speaking on it like it's, yo pussy, yo pussy ain't paying no bills. You know what I'm saying? I know that, I know that for a fact. Yo pussy don't give me no, no energizer to go pay these bills. It just give me a good time for real. That's all it do. And then if I kick you out and bring somebody else in, they can do the same shit that you're doing. That's what I'm saying. Which is nothing. Because y'all get what I'm saying. I don't got to stress this. I don't I don't know. Okay. But from my experience okay. in real life. But from my experience in real life. When my real bills got really paid. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whether it's the pussy, the head. Whether it's the pussy, the head, the head. Some got it wrong. If niggas are flying into like Lifestyle. Something might be there. I don't know if it's something might be there. I don't know if it's something might be there. 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 Something might be there.
go, no girls night out because all your girl friends are hoes. So like you know, like that's what I've he said. That. And he used to be no like, way. he used to be like, birds of a feather flock together. So if you go out with them, you'll he hope. told you that. Yeah, like he was. No way. He was mad. <laughs> <controlled. laughs> you over here instigating shit. So you know, like I stopped going out as much, and then it was like, okay, now you need your location on all the time because I need oh, to know where you at. Bro, like no. it just became like a. a controlling passwords Better. like of control Not yeah control. just more and more control because i just kept being submissive and he was like okay let's see what else i can do mm -hmm. like you know what i mean so i would uh respect his standards and his requirements but i would not be controlled like a child you know mm -hmm. i mean sure. we'll come back to that never mind <laughs> bro here, here's how i know it's cap because what you're gonna say i'm gonna listen to you and take all of those things into account you, if you take all those things into account and really listen to somebody and somebody really give you good reasoning, you know what I'm saying? It seemed like she the type to listen to respond, right? From Just from what she's saying, because she about to say, all right, no, I'm already knowing where it's about to go. I'm going to listen to everything, but then I'm going to let you know, like, what, what my standards and, you know what I'm saying, which is what you're supposed to do, you know what I'm saying, in a way, <clears throat> and everything like that. But if you listening and taking everything into account that you... Like the person you say you really love and you really fuck with. You know what I'm saying? That's why we can't, we use those words way too much. Love, I really fuck with you. I'm really down for you. All type of shit. Niggas, motherfuckers don't know what that shit really mean. If you really down for somebody, like I said earlier, sacrifice. You'll be willing to sacrifice shit like that. So when it comes to that, you're really not ready to be with somebody. Because those are two lives mushing together. You know what I mean? Two lives, two different standards. I'm sure that he, for your standards, he he backed away and shit like that. But if if he didn't, it would be because he paying all the goddamn bills. All the motherfucking bills. You are my kid. I keep stressing it because it just don't make sense. So yeah, it seemed like she the type to, she'll hear what you saying, but she not listening. You know what I'm saying? So she just listening to respond. And she gonna have a whole bunch of backlash. Like, let me just let her finish what she's saying, but. Okay, you know, I'm gonna pay attention to what you have to say. Now, the minute that I think what you're saying is absolutely ridiculous, uh, I just can't do it. Like, I'm gonna have a heart attack. So it's one of those situations where the minute that you try to control literally any aspect of my life that I feel is just absurd, like anything on Instagram, bro, it's social media, like get over it. This is the way that the new people literally do everything is through our social media if you're gonna have a problem with that i'm sorry you like don't belong in this century you should probably find somewhere else to go find a time machine because literally it's not that's not the way that the world works now like literally like i mean don't control so what if you just said you know what babe you're awesome i just oh i don't like when niggas hit you up don't respond to them at least so, I mean, with my job, that's not going to happen. <laughs> Literally, I'm an OnlyFans girl, my love. I'd be DMing dudes all day, baby. That's my job. Uh, like we could hire automation for it, baby. No, they know. I know my fans. I'm in the top point on one percent, <laughs> baby. I got to keep my percent. Okay. Well, yeah, got to keep it. That money. requires it's a business. lot. I have three. Oh, trust me, I got three sexters. I got two people on my thing, but I still like, bro. Even without me, it's crazy. Okay. It's mm -hmm. crazy. What about you? Yeah, no, I definitely won't be controlled. I think that's kind of what we've all, yeah, no. Why'd you get married? <laughs> well, no, I'm not married yet. I am getting married in August, but he doesn't control me. He doesn't, I mean, he doesn't, we talk about standards all the time and we talk about um, what works for us and we communicate about that. But what's that. the point of getting married then? What well, I'm not getting controlled. That's not, you know, like getting married doesn't mean that you that just give up control. That's exactly what it is. No, absolutely not. No, not when, now, you're not signing now. a contract to be together. Yeah, to be as one. together as, as one. one. Exactly. Yeah, as that's one. what I was going to say. But it's not a control. It's not giving up it's control. Team. It's giving up you as a single person. Mm. Well, I mean, I gave up being a single person back when I was 15. Like, but you now know, legally I, you're doing it. <laughs> <laughs> legally signing away. Like, doing like, it for years. Not, like, yeah, there's no difference there. It's just you got to communicate. So, I mean, some people. No, don't. Hey. There is a difference with marriage, nigga. Don't y'all don't listen to that shit. There's a difference with marriage. That's why motherfuckers get a prenup sign. Cause money come into the shit. You combining your see, see, that's the problem. And that's the problem. Cause some of you women, y'all don't see a difference between marriage. There's the big difference. Marriage. When you ever, whenever in your life 
you got to sign papers for some shit. There's a difference. You know what I'm saying? It's there's there's not it, it's it's not going to be it's not going to be the same shit. That's why most people whenever they get married, they know it's going to be different. That's why most people hold out, hold out so long on a marriage because that that shit's real. You know what I'm saying? That that that's a real thing. I don't I don't I don't get it. I don't so it, it is a difference. A whole lot of other shit get involved whenever it's it's a marriage. It's a legit marriage. Unless y'all just bullshit. Unless y'all if y'all bullshit, do your thing. You know what I'm saying? But I'm just saying, there's a difference. Well, maybe, maybe like, like, yeah, okay, I'm, I'm cool, cool with, with you, you telling, telling me what to do, and I'm just, I'm just not, not like that. that. And like, so, 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 I'm, so, I'm, so I'm curious. curious. You're, you're, you're your man, man right? right? He lets, he lets you do whatever, whatever you want? Well, no. well, no, I mean, I mean like I said, we have standards that we talk about, and we're just like, yeah, yeah I'm not cool with you doing that, and you're not cool with me doing this. I'm like, okay. okay. I mean, sometimes, sometimes I still, I still don't, don't do the dishes, dishes but. but no. <laughs> 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 All right, man. That's that's gonna be the end of this video. I know I made it like hella long. I hope if you stay to the end, I appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? We just sometimes we got really got to unpack what the fuck is going on in this world, in the dating world. You know what I'm saying? All type of shit. Um, Let's talk about. Anyway, uh, as far as all that shit go, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, just find somebody for you, you know, that is willing to, you know, compromise, sacrifice, you know what I'm saying? All type of shit, what you got going. But at the end of the day, most of the time we young right now, most people, they don't know what they want, which is fine. You young, you're not supposed to know what you want all the time. You know what I'm saying? Some people believe they know what they want, then they get into it, and it's not really what they want. Your feelings change all the time, so it's really hard to trust a lot of shit. You know what I'm saying? So you can't really blame somebody for that. You know? Um, but yeah, like I said, with relationships, most of the time it's just two lives. You gotta learn. You gotta learn to work with that one person. That's all it is. And if there's shit that you're like, I just can't do that. I won't do that. It'll never work out because there will always be that one problem in the relationship. That is like, damn, you sac you say you love me, you say you fuck with me, say all this, but you can't sacrifice this. That's always going to rub somebody different, regardless of what the situation is. I don't care if it's uh, you put syrup on my pancake and I told you I don't like that shit. You know what I'm saying? I want that shit buttery, no syrup, because that's just not how I rock. And you keep putting syrup on my pancake every single morning. I know that might not be like the right analogy, but I, if you understand, you understand. You know what I'm saying? But that's going to be the end of this video. You know what I'm saying? If you fucked with it, I appreciate it. If you stay to the end, thank you so much. I love y'all, man. And I want y'all to have a good day. And make sure you do something productive today. You know what I'm saying? Don't just be sitting on your ass all day. You know what I'm saying? Um, Yeah, I'm going to holla at y'all boys in the next one. Until next time, it's been your boy Jerry. And I'm out.